Hey, y'all know what they say. You learn something new every day. And if you haven't, here's a chance. So I'm here to talk to you about the time value of money. So time value of money is a term used to calculate future value and present value or present value, the future value. So there are equations for both of these values. I do have it written down, but I want to break it down for y'all on an old school whiteboard. Check me out. Check me out. So you got the present value of $10,000, right? At 20 years at 6%. So you got the future value equals the present present value times one plus the rate times the number of years. Rate times number of years. If you know any basic math, plug it in. You got the 10,000 times one plus 6%. And one plus 6% is 1.06, 20 number of years. You take your future value. Yeah, I just check out my painting real quick. My boy Snub on Instagram sent me a live as pain y'all go check them out yeah i know i'm from the 210 chef key tv so what i just showed you guys how to do was turn ten thousand dollars into a present value and turn it into thirty two thousand dollars of future value but let's take oh my goodness it's because i'm looking at the camera let's take 10 years right let's turn a future value of 10 years of a hundred thousand dollars take 10 years six percent turn it into present value so this equation is going to be a little different. We're turning present value into future value, right? So we got the present value, which is going to drop down. Future value divided by 1 plus the rate plus the number of years, right? So here you go. Future value is $100,000. No cuts. This is live. Let's get it. So times the same 6%, 1 plus 0 0.06, which is the same one point. Zero six the number of years is 10 years so i just showed you guys how to take present value to future value using 20 years and six percent here using this equation and i also showed you guys how to take future value of a hundred thousand from 10 years six percent using this equation the only difference is the division right here and the multiplication right here boop, boop, boop. So if you've come this far and you don't know what to apply this with, then comment for part two and I can share how do you apply this knowledge? How do you apply learning of the future value or the present value of a number? How do you apply it? Y'all comment if y'all want to know. And that's what you call time value of money.